Well, the hotter and sunnier it is, the more people come out. Um, colder, rainier, cloudier, less people. Well, as Mark just said, the holiday weekend not shaping up to be the best weather wise. So will this not so sunny forecast put a damper on some outdoor businesses? Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Courtney Zeller is joining us live from the Connecticut River in Windsor with more on what business owners are saying. Not ideal conditions, Courtney. Well, Aaron, no, not at all. And, you know, it is supposed to be, right, a busy holiday weekend. But, you know, these business owners, we talked to two of them today, they don't seem too concerned. Uh, they think the weather won't stop people from heading out. Is it a hole in one? Well, not quite, but still a good shot. Despite a few raindrops, these kids are having a blast at Matterhorn Mini Golf in Canton. And obviously weather does impact our business. So we're looking forward to the 4th of July weekend to celebrate our country's <laughs> history. But at the same time, families want to get together, get outside. Even with the holiday weekend weather not being the best, owner Autumn Sutherland says she still expects to be busy. We only close in case of thunder and lightning. So even in a light drizzle, we've got people on the course right now having a good time. Down the road at Farmington River tubing. Manager Jeremy Harridan expects to see a good amount of tubers. Lots of people. Uh, everybody's ready to get out of the house, uh, come out to nature, uh, go for a trip down the river. Um, Sunday, Monday would probably be the busiest days. That's because the weather will likely be a lot nicer and warmer. Um, you're going to be in the river, you're getting wet anyway, so a little rain isn't going to bother much. You just get wet from the top as well as the bottom. While he doesn't know if it will be a record number of customers, he says he did have a record number of people visiting their website yesterday. So many, it crashed. I think there's a lot of people out there that are making plans for the weekend, getting ready to come out and recreate. Um, so, yeah, it'll be interesting to see what comes this weekend. Now, as for the weather hurting these businesses' bottom line, while well, they say... It all equals out at the end of the season. We're live from Windsor tonight. Courtney Zeller, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.